first little bit of downhill coming here it looks like <clears throat> not a big one but I'll take it <clears throat> 85 RPM Thirty-two. Here's the Hopper Cemetery where all the horses were yesterday. But they're not here today. This is a pretty good example of a lot of the roads here with the deeper canopy right by the road a mixture of hardwoods and pines as you see ahead of you and I love these creek bottoms they're nice and cool this morning I think that's a little fox Bobcat. Ah, that's what I was looking for. This is the turnaround point. This is all the Washita National Forest and has been for some time. This road leads on up to the Albert Pike Recreation Area, the one that flooded so terribly. What, in 2009? A lot of people died in a flash flood in the middle of the night. I can't tell if that's one or two dogs. It's two. <laughs> I hope you can hear that. I wonder if they have something treed. Here we are headed back easterly now, actually about south-southeast. <clears throat> that gives you a good idea of the rising terrain. We've climbed almost 300 feet in the process of getting here, about uh, 290 which is enough. I love the forest in the morning. Soft lights, many sounds including howling dogs. <laughs> yeah, I thought I saw him move. It's a different looking turtle. Let's see if I can straighten that camera a little bit. Okay, Susan Ellis, this is for you. Tell me once again about how flat this road is. <laughs> Not hardly. Fun down. Work it going back up. Get it back in the top ring. And away we go. And this water tower that we're about to see means I'm almost back to the point of beginning. Nice downhill run here for oh, probably two miles. <laughs> 